Welcome to Definite Mind. In this video, we will know about cosine rule and its applications. After that, we will solve few problems. So, please watch this video till last. Now, as you can see, this is a any triangle. Let's suppose ABC and opposite to angle A, side length is let's suppose A and opposite to angle B small b and opposite to angle C is small c ok and if we draw height of this triangle ok and this suppose a height length is h and if I consider this length is x means this to this length and this length is definitely a minus x because whole length is a then we will subtract a minus x then we will get this length and as we can see this is a right ang angle triangle and this is also a right angle triangle so by using Pythagoras theorem we can write h square equal to for this triangle hypotenuse square minus base square that is c square minus x square and for this triangle also we can write h square equal to b square minus a minus x whole square so we can equal it so i am equal equating this b square minus a minus x whole square and if we expand then we can write c square minus x square equal to b square minus a square minus x square plus 2ax and we can cancel this so we can write if we take a is minus a square this side a square plus c square and minus b square equal to 2a and in this triangle means this triangle if for angle b cos theta equal to cos b equal to what base by hypotenuse base is x and hypotenuse is c so we can write x y c this means x equal to c cos v and if we put the value of x in this here then we can write 2 a c cos b equal to a square plus c square minus b square this means cos b equal to a square plus c square minus b square to ac as you can see cos b equal to we will write a square plus c square and we subtract b square angle b is here so we will subtract b square over 2 ac product of this two so we can write also for cos c that is we will write here a square plus b square and we will subtract angle c opposite sides that is small c square over 2ab okay and similarly we can write for cos a that is we will subtract a square over here b square plus c square 2bc these are the required formula we will use and its application we will use when we will need to find the side length of the triangle or cord length in the circles okay this is the very important formulas now we will solve few problems as we can see in this problem it is given angle a equal to 120 and side length ab is 6 and ac is 8 and we have to find the side length bc that is value of x how we can find we will use cosine rule here for this angle that is we can write cos 120 equal to a square of this side and plus a square of this side minus a square of x square that is 6 square plus 8 square minus x square over 2 into 6 into 8 and cos 120 is minus 1 by 2 and 36 plus 64 minus x square equal to 2 into 6 into 8 
2 to get cancelled then we can write 6 into 8 48 minus 48 here cross multiplying after and this is 100 this will go that is we can write x square equal to 148 this means x equal to under root 148 which is equal to 2 under root 37 this is the right answer for this question and next question this is a very important question for various examinations okay in this question there is a triangle side length is AC is 20 and side length of BC is 10 and area of this triangle is 80 given and we have to find the side length AB okay how we can solve this we will use cosine rule here also as we can know for this angle because we have to find the AB and opposite to AB side angle is C so we can write here cos C equal to what we can write cos C equal to square of this side and square of this side that is 10 square plus 20 square and minus square of this side that is AB square over 10 to into 10 into 20 but we don't know cos C actually for this there is important concept if there is any triangle that is any triangle and it is given this angle is theta and this side length is x and this side length is y then area equal to what area of this triangle equal to 1 by 2 x y sin theta this is the important formula also so by using this we can write here and if we consider this is theta okay that is c yeah let's suppose this is c angle then we can write area equal to 1 by 2 this and this that is 10 into 20 into sin c and area of this triangle is what 80 we can equal it 24 times and 2 5 times then we can write sin c equal to 4 by 5 so we can calculate cos c equal to 3 by 5 from this relation and we will put here value of cos c that is 3 by 5 100 400 minus ab square and 2 into 10 into 20 4 times and this is 40 80 and 240 and this is 500 if we subtract 500 minus 240 we will get 260 so we can write ab square equal to under root 260 sorry ab equal to this is the required answer thanks for watching this video and please like share and subscribe this channel also